in Solano County spent the night monitoring any hot spots that were remaining from the quail fire, which forced mandatory evacuations late yesterday afternoon. That fire burned at least 135 acres and caused some very scary moments for people living in the area near Quail Ridge Road and Pleasance Valley Road. This is between Winters and Vacaville. Orcomana has the very latest. Cal Fire helicopters and air tankers doing water and fire retardant drops all afternoon on the Quail Fire in Vacaville. Plumes of smoke billowing off this hillside near Quail Canyon Road and Pleasance Valley Road as the flames burned more than 100 acres. I saw a lot of smoke, a lot of noise. The ranch Mel Topons has lived on for more than 40 years is nearby. He tells KCRA 3 the fire almost reached his property. It stopped just right very close to the edge of it. Homeowners across the area, including Topons, issued evacuation orders during the height of the fire. The Solano County Office of Emergency Services saying there was a potential threat to life and or property. Several Cal Fire engines, local fire units and Solano County emergency vehicles responding to the fire. Crews have been making progress with containment efforts on the quail fire. You can see up here some of that red retardant on the side of the hill that the Cal Fire aircraft have been dropping on the side here all afternoon. But again, they are still working to contain the rest of the fire. And what's proving to be a challenge is the landscape. The fire ran up the hill and uh, it caused it caused issues because of the terrain and also the steep uh, uh, the steep hills that we're dealing with on getting uh, a full containment and wrap on that fire uh, quickly. Reporting in Vacaville, Orco Mana, KCRA 3 News. And here's a live view from the alert wildfire of the burn scar of the quail fire. All evacuation orders have been reduced to warnings, which means residents just need to be prepared to leave in case things flare up once again. Now investigators are looking into what sparked the fire in the first place.